I think that um, I think that probably the biggest thing for me is to just think about how people think. Uh, the patient in front of you, the student in front of you, doesn't really um, it doesn't matter. I think that having an understanding of that is very helpful. I know that as an instructor uh, teaching PT students, it's made a big difference just in terms of understanding. I think probably the biggest thing is just understanding the fact that they are going to struggle with certain things mm -hmm. because of how they organize certain things. Mm -hmm. And so uh, a certain amount of that teaching process is you got to let people go on their own adventure. You may be able to tell them what it's going to look like. They may not listen. Patients are the same. They're going to do what they're going to do sometimes, whether you gave them advice or not. But then the question is, how do you how do you get that to convert into something positive to make it a positive experience? So I think that just simply understanding that the thought process, the cognitive process, how somebody thinks about something is um, hugely valuable. Uh, knowing that there's a lot of literature out there for that, uh, you can wade into lots of really cool stuff about brain and learning. Um, 